Hello everyone and welcome to the latest SNP Members Update. This has been a busy week. We've seen the UK government publish their proposals to implement the Smith Commission. We think in key areas what they've done is water down the proposals of the Smith Commission. For example, they think that Westminster should have a veto over whether or not the Scottish Parliament can abolish the bedroom tax. That's not acceptable. And even though we think the Smith Commission proposals should go much further than they do, uh, we still think that what Smith proposed should be implemented in full and that's what we'll be working to achieve. Uh, we've also, this week, put the NHS at the heart of the general election campaign. I've made very clear that SNP MPs in the House of Commons would be prepared to vote on matters relating to the English Health Service if that was necessary to protect Scotland's budget because we know that decisions about the funding of the health service in England have a direct impact through the Barnett formula on how much money our parliament has to spend. And of course, by voting to restore the English Health Service and to halt privatisation, I'm sure we'd be joining with other progressive forces to challenge the Westminster establishment. Other good news this week, it seems that the broadcasters have backed down and agreed to include the SNP, the Greens and Plaid Cymru in the TV leaders' election debates. I'm really looking forward to taking part in those debates and making sure that Scotland's voice is heard loudly and clearly in them. This weekend, I'm off to London. I'll be appearing on the Andrew Marr Show on Sunday morning, and I hope uh, you're all up bright and early watching. Uh, so I hope you've found this update useful. I look forward to talking to you again soon. Uh, please share this message on your social media channels, and please, Follow me on Twitter and Facebook. You can use the links below. In the meantime, have a great weekend.